in part two to my part one of um the Drake's Fortune Belt Buckle Redo. Re 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 <sighs> oh my god, I can't I can't speak English for anything. In part two to my part one of the Drake's Fortune Belt Buckle Review. This is part two. Um, picking up where I left off. Um, if, if you don't already know this about me, I'm a huge, huge fan of Drake's Fortune. So um, when I saw this on Etsy, I, I was just immediately happy with it. Um, and the product pictures kind of deceived me. Um, I kind of fell into my own deception. I'll, um, I'll let you guys figure that reference out for itself. Um, it, it's, it's lazy. It's, it's simply lazy compared to, compared to a lot of other Drake's Fortune Belt buckles I've seen. Um, and if you don't already know it, I, I don't like lazily done stuff. Especially for the price I paid. I paid $22 for this. And this is what came to my house. I, it's it's just underline lazy. There's spots where the paint isn't. The the teeth are kind of callous and like you don't even know there's teeth there unless you get really up close and personal. The paint is all messed up. The paint is wrinkly. It's bubbled. It's it's just bad news all around. The like the color the color of the original. Like, the color that's underneath the spray paint is coming off. Or, com uh, the spray paint is coming off the original color. So, this thing is deteriorating. It's, it's lazy, and it's, and I'm... Oh, uh... Um, and also have another product. I've owned, the product I'm about to show you, I've owned since 2017. I know, right? I don't. I I take my Uncharted stuff seriously. Um, that would be the officially listed, um, Uncharted Three Drake's Deception belt buckle. I and I know this is all dark and it's spotty. I've owned this for 2017, 2018, 2019. I've owned this for five years. Five years, five, no, not five, four, four years. Let's, let's go nuts and say four years. Okay. Yeah, four years. I've owned this for four whole years. So, and I, and I want you to compare the quality of this. This was also, this was dirt cheap. And I got this off Amazon. And Etsy is more expensive than Amazon. What does what does that tell you? I want you to compare. Oh, it's upside down. Come on. I I want you to compare the quality. This is brand new. This is brand speaking new. It's lazy. It's callous, and it and it's just hard to look at. This is this is good quality. It's it's solid and it's not lazy. It's well done. And this is in case and this is this is real brass. It has a connector, so you can you can actually wear this. Whereas this is just a just a shell of what it was in the pictures. This is it's just lazy. It's just lazy. Just compare the quality of something I got for eleven dollars versus twenty two dollars. What does that tell you? $22, one year old. $11, four years old. What does that tell you? It's just, it, it's okay. It, it's okay. Um, and, I, and I would like it if there, if in the future, if, if he ever does these again, that if you're, if you're watching this, um, please just, Put more effort into your products. I I am a really big fan of your shop on Etsy. I love the stuff you do. I love your channel. It's it's all wonderful. But please just try to put more effort into this stuff, especially 
because I, I fell into my own thoughts. I was too deep in my deception to, to really think to myself, okay, this could be, this could be a scam. This could not be what it is in the pictures. And it showed up, and it showed up looking like this. When in the product pictures, it, it looked good. It, it looked good. It was actually shiny. The paint was nice and thick. It wasn't all messed up and bubbly like this. It wasn't, it just wasn't lazy, underline lazy. Like, look at this, this, look at this. Come on, man, look at this. That's where I tried to glue it onto my belt, so there's actual proof. And then you got all these lines and, and pits in here for no reason. It's just kind of effortless and just effortless and lazy. Four years I've owned this. And this still looks amazing. I will be proud to wear this on my waist. I will be proud to say that I've owned this. I will not wear this on my waist. I can't wear this on my waist. I'm not proud of it. I'm actually quite embarrassed that I even own this in the first place. It's lazy. That's going to wrap up the review. Um, again, if you're out there, please, more effort. Just hold up, hold up to your name. There's nothing, there's nothing I need, there's nothing else I need to say. Just look at this. Nothing else I need to say. This has been Puffy's Guy 9000. I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.